Hello everybody, good Monday afternoon, hope you all having a great day today. Happy November everybody, it's the start of a new month. So let's start out this month with a fantastic video. It's time for ASMR. Today's title is, is, Be Respectful. I hope this video motivates you and inspires you to be respectful. You know, with all the stuff that's going on right now, close to, with voting being tomorrow and everything, here in America, we need to be respectful of other people. We need to be, you and I need to be respectful to other people who don't agree with us. It's called common, common courtesy. I know that there are a lot of people on this channel who, who I may never meet, and that's fine, but I know who are respectful of me and my views, just like I am I am respectful of you and your views, no matter what they are. So, are you being respectful? You say, well, who do I need to be respectful to? Well, you need to be respectful, first of all, to God. Because you need to be respectful to Him, because He's God. He's the Creator. You're not. I'm not. You need to be respectful to Him, because because He's God, and He created you. And He respect, and He demands respect. Second, you need to be respectful to people in authority, like your parents. Now, I know most people who watch these videos are over 18, but there are some who watch it who, who, are, who are 17 and younger. So I'm going to just talk for a few minutes to the young people. You say, I don't want to be respectful to my parents. You have to be. Why, you say? Well, because they are still your parents. They see things and know things that that you don't. They have lived a lot longer than you have. And yes, I know times have changed. And and just to let you know, teenagers out there, your parents are smarter than you. You may not think that. You may think that you're smarter than your parents. And some are, yes, some are highly intelligent. Some teenagers out there are highly intelligent, yes. But when the sun goes down at the end of the day, your parents are still your parents. And you must show them respect and be respectful to them and their authority. Whether it's whether you grew up with a mom and dad and both, and, uh, or you grew up with just a single parent like I did. Or you grew up with a mom and no dad or a dad and no mom. Or perhaps even your grandparents raised you. No matter what the case, make sure that you are respectful to them, period. Next is being respectful to your friends. And I know it's hard. It's hard nowadays to be respectful, respectful to your friends because we all have different ideas, different ways of life. And I know that, you know, especially... Nowadays, with the election coming up and everything again, that people don't respect each other just because they vote a certain way or they vote for this candidate or that candidate. And it tends to, usually your friendships are like this, but when it comes to certain issues, especially on voting or whatever, it tends to rip apart and you have strange relationship just because you don't respect a person's viewpoint. So, please, respect your friends, no matter what what political party they are. I, and, and as you know, you already know who I voted for. I'm not afraid of saying it. And I know that a lot of people who don't agree with my choice, and that's okay. I still, I still respect your decision just as I respect you, even though I may, even though I may never physically see you in person, face to face. But I know that there are, that on the other side of this camp, other side of the screen, there is somebody watching it. There's another human being watching this video. So, respect your, respect God, respect your parents, respect your friends. Next, respect the people in authority, like your police, like the like. Respect law enforcement. I know that's a that's a huge, huge issue. Just to, to 
tuck on, and I know it's hard because, you know, you see on the news that, you know, a black person got killed by a white officer, therefore there should be no, you know, respect towards any officers, no matter what skin tone. Well, you're wrong. I respect officers, police officers, and it doesn't matter to me what color they are, whether they're brown like me, a little bit darker, lighter, if they're American, Asian, Hispanic, whatever, and if they wear the badge, I'm going to respect them. Period. Why? You say, why do I need to respect the police officers? Because they are there to protect you. They are there to protect you. They're there to protect and serve you as a member of the of the community. You say, I don't want to, I don't want to respect the police officers. I see too much bad stuff. There's a lot of bad cop out there. Some of them, yes. Yes, some cops, yes, are bad out there. But you can't say all of them, because there are a lot of good police officers out there, and police women, too. So, you cannot say that all police officers are bad. You can't say that. But please respect them, no matter what they're doing. If they, if they pull you over, just be respectful. Okay? Be be respectful to them because they are they have the badge. I want you out there to guys you guys today to be respectful. Okay? Guys, if you like this video, you know what to do. Watch, like, share, comment, subscribe. Have a great afternoon, everybody. Happy November. God bless. Remember, you are loved by God. Have a great day everybody. God bless you all.